aggressive, especially for an All Star game in the first quarter. Was that your intent? Yeah, we wanted to be aggressive. You know, as we talked about it you know, before going out there. You know, we wanted to play. You know, we lost last year, and uh, we wanted to make sure we came out here and played the game hard, and um, you know, come out of here with a win. Shaq, could you talk a little bit about your dance moves? Uh, I wanted to uh, do something a little different, a little unique, and Jabberwockies is the uh, best dance crew out there. So, you know, I just wanted to be be different. I uh, I realized that this may possibly be my last one, so I wanted to uh, make it memorable, memorable for myself and for the fans. Howard, Kobe, I, I know you're not exact. Duck back here. I know you're not exactly the sentimental type, but when you guys are having the interaction on the court, feel like old times a little bit. Does it make you a little bit at all wistful for being able to play with Shaq, having those those moments? No. <laughs> Sha- Shaq? No. <laughs> not even a little. It was fun. It was fun, you know, for us to interact like that. It's just fun. We're just having fun, you know, in terms of being nostalgic. I mean, not. And I uh, told him really. to be sure that, you know, it felt like old times. Missed those times. You know, he was really uh, uh, looking for me, especially when they was uh, when we went to the pick and roll and they had Rasha or Lewis on me, so he was really looking looking for me. But so we're not you know, we're not like gonna go back to the room and like watch yeah. still Magnolias yeah. or something like that. <laughs> yeah, like, exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like cry and all that stuff. I mean, yeah, you just had that, a good time, yeah, that's all. Yeah. <laughs> Steel Magnolia's isn't even on tonight. Uh, <laughs> Kobe with 27, Shaq with 17. GP, the last time these guys played together, mm-hmm. it was June of 2004. It was game five in the finals against Detroit. And you were there. You were in the starting lineup with them. Right. Uh, what is it like for you to watch them now compared to what you knew that season with their relationship? Well, Ernie, is a big difference because of the simple fact they have grown up. You know, they, they, they don't put everything past them. You know, Shaq came out with the little rap. I think he does that just because he wants to get attention. But I think Kobe has grown up a lot more now. And, and it was just one of them things. Them guys, I take it like with uh, Jordan and Pippen. They didn't have to get along, but they won championships. And this is how these guys go. You don't have to go home with them and eat with them and do anything. Just when we get on the court, let's play basketball. And they, they're okay. They're good with it. Even if they're acting and faking right now, you know what I'm saying, it's still good with me for them to react like that. I don't think they're acting and faking, do you? I mean, do you think? I mean, I think they have matured past that. I think they put a lot of that stuff behind them. Well, I think they put it behind them, I think. But there's, you know, obviously there's still tension in the sense that it isn't all forgotten and, for, and forgiven. I right. think that, that these two guys are one, they're the ultimate competitors. And they, be, they, they are this good because of that competitive nature. And any time that someone questions your competitive nature and how good you are, I think that, hurt, that hurts you as a, a player. These are two MVPs. All-star MVPs. These guys have have egos that actually have helped them and propelled them to be better than they probably would have been. I just wish they would have broke up before uh, Ori hit that shot. On <laughs> <laughs> and then you could have got, 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 got a ring. Huh? Yeah, if they would have broke up a long time ago, yeah. I had to play against yeah. the greatest yeah. two guys yeah. in the world. So, yeah, nah, not, not who is it who needs to move past something. Maybe <laughs> see what. Exactly. Uh, we'll be back with more here on NBA TV. Inside the NBA presented by Hyundai, the wrestling match over the MVP trophy of the 2009 All-Star Game. I love you, oh, man. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Oh, Day. Oh, Y'all Shaq went too far. Us for you went too far. <laughs> GP saying you're going too far. Y'all too far. Y'all too far.